Hello everyone, this is Fatma from Wafa Crochet. Welcome to my channel. So in this tutorial, I'm gonna teach you the easiest way on how to do a slip knot. So what's a slip knot? A slip knot is the first step in almost all crochet patterns and projects. There are multiple ways to create slip knot. And some might be a little confusing. So I happen to find the easiest way to do a slip knot for complete beginners. So a slip knot is like it's your starter for each project. Before we begin, you will need a thick weight yarn so you can manipulate with it and you can practice on it. And you will need a crochet hook. I use the four millimeters crochet hook. You can use any type of yarn and any crochet hook, but I prefer a thick weight yarn and a crochet hook. Stay with me. So what you need to do is you will take three to four inches of the yarn and you will put it on the table like this. You will take the yarn attached to the ball and you will put it across or over the yarn that you have made. Now you have a loop and a cross. What you are gonna do is you will take two fingers of your dominant hand. My dominant hand of course is left hand. I'm um, left handed by the way. And uh, you will just take two fingers, go below the cross that you made and pull a loop from the yarn from the uh, from the thread attached to the yarn and take it out while you are taking the loop i'll just hold the this yarn on the table and voila your slip knot is ready i'm gonna do it again for you so you can do it correctly with me Take three to four inches of the yarn, put it on the table, take the, the yarn that's attached to the ball and put it over the yarn that you have done here. Now you have the cross and the loop. Take two fingers, go below the X that you have created and pull a loop from the yarn that's attached to the ball. And while you are pulling, pull this yarn and Voila, your slip knot is ready. Uh, by the way, I'm not using this method. This method is for complete beginners, so you you have you learn how to do a slip knot. Um, usually, my slip knot will be like this. This is for uh, for professionals, and you can maybe you can do it. Just uh, be, uh, just stay with me. Uh, hold the thumb. Take two fingers. Wrap the yarn, the yarn once on your finger. Take the inner loop, put it between two, between these two fingers, and take this loop. And while you are taking this, just hold with two fingers, and like this, and voila, your slip knot is ready. Now, how to do? How to take control? What uh, of the? Uh, how to take control of the slip knot? Okay, so the slip knot has like special features. You can control the width of the loop. Okay, uh, take the crochet hook, put it inside the loop. By the way, in crochet, this loop is not considered as a stitch. Uh, if you want it smaller, you just go and pull the yarn attached to the ball. I mean, uh, if you want it bigger, sorry. And if you want it smaller, just pull the yarn attached, uh, the yarn, the remaining yarn, it will be smaller. Bigger, smaller. And if you change your mind and you don't want to start with this yarn or you want to, to change the project or you want to cancel the slip knot, easily you can do like this. Voila! And yeah, that's the end of the, cro the tutorial today. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more videos. Bye.